YouTube. The title of this video is not a lie. At least I don't think it is. I think this might be one of the greatest, if not the greatest, silent run that I have ever played. It's got everything you want. It's got fun cards like the bomb and grand finale. Chat not believing that the deck's going to work and then I prove them wrong. Me getting salty as hell at backseaters. It's got it all. Hope you enjoy the content. If you do, please give it a like, give it a comment. Tell me what your uh, favorite part is or make fun of me for getting angry. Whichever one you want. I appreciate you all. Please subscribe like 40% of you are and I know who you are. And you will be getting a letter in the mail. You won't, actually. I don't actually know who you are. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much. Mwah. Hello there. All right, this one I'm going to play Omega Series. Trust me. Lock yourself in. Type some peepo Gs if you're learning anything. And watch a gamer at work. There's a triple elite path and a quadruple elite path. I have a bomb. I don't, I don't think that I want a bomb. Do it. I have a bomb. <laughs> Got another bomb build. I actually think bomb was the best. Like, no joke. It's not. I didn't, I didn't even take it as a meme. I, 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 th I think the, the bomb was just genuinely the best there. You take a sucker punch, actually. Sucker punch is really good into the boss. Awkward to find you here, man. Yep. Can't wait for this bomb to blow its load all over me. Uh, dagger spray is not terrible, but I don't think we need it if we have Boomba. So I'll skip. Dude, what the hell? <laughs> what the f- I'm getting trolled. That help me. <laughs> actually trolled. What the fuck is that? I guess I could take a blade dance. It's not really good in the Guardian, but it is the best thing on the market right now. It is a blade dance too. I feel like this deck just flops hard. <laughs> I feel like this deck is just gonna, it's just gonna flop like a wet noodle. Like we want to go this way and then just take nothing but hard all act, act one hallway fights. They're just like, actually really hard. Just to play Isaac, yeah, occasionally. On occasion. Peglin got another new patch. That's sick. I'm taking one more billion damage. How's it going with you? Hi, doggo. Hi, Bubby. Are you a good boy? Hmm. Yo, a reflex to get more bombs off? Yes! All of these cards are trash. Like, this deck is actually trash, Chad. I cannot express it enough. Okay. Uh, I'll take an accuracy. Hopefully that does anything. The constant turn ones where we're not getting attacked and yet all we draw is basic strikes and defense. When we have a lot more in our deck to offer in terms of setup for fights, just feels atrocious. But a bottled bomb? <laughs> Wait a second. He can't, he can't get away with this. He's too powerful. What up, Cleary? Oh, you're gonna blow? What are you gonna hit me for? 30 damage? 10, 50! This deck is gonna, we're gonna die, Chad. Wow, I got a very useful relic that's going to help against this elite fight. I can't wait.
Don't worry, he's already half death. Half dead. We got him on the ropes. Hannah's not got a McDonald's now. Okay. We need one more attack. That is one more attack. Love that. We made it through the Lagavulin fight. We got a prayer wheel. We got a burst for our Boomba. And we're at 7 HP going to the next fight, baby. You can't hold me the hell down. Not a damn chance. Watch this. Oh! I like it deflect. Another acrobatics. And then we probably drink our fruity juice here. And then go here and rest. I'm going to take this secret technique. Huh. I think it's going to be really strong. There's a chest. There's a... Why do I get pendant every single fucking time? I feel like I can't stop getting the damn pendant, man. All right. Let us upgrade our burst. Because on turn one of this fight, we're going to draw bomb and secret technique. And burst. What? <laughs> boom, boom. I guess we can use it to draw two shitty cards. <laughs> Nah, we're fine. Look at this. Now we just have to survive this turn. I'm surviving. Ah! No! Don't do it! I'm a virgin! Okay, sick. Okay. Now, how are we surviving these upcoming turns, you ask? Shut up. We do not have the mana to do anything good here. We actually just have to bomb Sucker Punch. <laughs> no, I guess we could... No, it's, just, it's literally the same amount to bomb... Bomb Survivor. Doesn't matter. Technically, we could have done four more damage. Yo, what up, dog? We actually might have this here. We actually might have this. We just need to survive this turn and next. We just need to... We, no, we don't even need to survive this next turn. Get blown up. This is ass chat. This is so bad. How is this bomb deck staying afloat? Doppel is underrated, but good with burst. It would be bad if I took this, right? I shouldn't. I shouldn't take the coffee dripper. Right? I shouldn't. I should not take the coffee. I shouldn't click on the... Should we just go straight for a floor six burning elite? We have the bomb. What, what's going to stop us? Are you going to stop us, Chant? I didn't fucking think so. I have all these cards. But I don't need any of them. <laughs> uh, prepare to sick. Another acrobatics is pretty sick. I could go here and remove, actually. Just use this shop as a removal sign. The homie. Oh, oh. I'll see you later, homie. See you later, dog. Do not want to become cursed. Thank you for the offer, though. Less cards. Muscle Manos. Do I do it, Chen? This has to be the Bloody Idol event, and we're just going to get smacked here. This has to be the Bloody Idol event. I believe it's nothing else. I will believe it is nothing else. I'm not duplicating the bomb, if that's what you're thinking. Boo. Don't hit me with the Dan Giesling emote and say more bombs. I'll take burst. 
This is scary. This is scary. This is scary. Don't think about it. Don't think about it, chat. Just fucking just uh, burst your boombas. Just burst your boom. Just burst your boomba. Don't worry about the fact that you're about to die. You don't need to worry about it. Don't even... Are we dead? Are we, like, actually dead? <laughs> All right, next turn we win. Okay. Could get five HP here. That's pretty good. I do like five more HP. I feel like you have to go here to try to get apparitions, right? Like campfires are not our friends right now. Oh, no. That's not apparitions. I do love our bottled burst, although it's not entirely necessary here. All right, both of you guys upgrade this turn. Upgrade. Upgrade now. Thanks. Okay. One damage, not bad. One damage, we can survive. <laughs> An eviscerate plus. Is that what we need as like an alternative form of damage? We do have three acrobatics, a prepared, and a survivor. I think I'll take it. Boom. I have a maw bank and the bird faced urn like it's some form of healing but we have no powers it's okay we'll find wraith forms i think <laughs> watch this burst boomba apparition and now we literally can't take damage as long as we draw like one defend there's like one defend this turn i did it i did it Oh my god! They're gonna get me! I didn't play my power, did I? <laughs> uh, heal. You didn't heal. Alright, if we got the well aid plants plus, you definitely want the apparitions. You could actually go ritual dagger i don't think so though i think i think the bomb's gonna Love kill things move. too often remove all strikes obtain five bites also a big fat no thank you i don't i don't believe courier with the maw bank seems too good to pass up yeah we're probably gonna try to save this maw bank all the way into the final act if we even live past this one fight <laughs> this deck fucks does it does it fuck, chat? Yes. Does this deck fuck, or, you just, or do you just want to fuck this deck? These are the questions we have to ask ourselves. <gasps> My burst! What are you going to steal? My secret technique! That's what I'm looking for, baby. Take one of these. Let's keep around you and you. Yep. I would very much like to do this. Draw a little bit extra next turn. You keep apparition secret technique. You draw a burst or your bomb. Burst or the bomb. A burst or the bomb. That's what you love to see. Because now I can secret technique for Boomba. And then I can burst Boomba. Apparition. And now we just need to deal 70 damage. 70 D.
Okay. 7 DD, 7 DD. We do have the, the explosive if we need it, but I don't believe we will. Especially not with uh, our 7 DD applicator tool. <laughs> Hi, Bumba. Okay, did not need to use that there, but I'll keep the bomb in my hand because it's the only card that we need, baby. Chad, why is there not a lot of hype right now going on in this deck? Right now? In this chat? Huh? I'm seeing a very lack of hype right now. <laughs> no, you definitely want the hovering kite here. We've got one, two, three, four, uh, five applicators right now of the, the discard. You could take the wrist blade, though. You could take the wrist blade. It does help. No, I, I thought you were popping off because of the after image. No, I don't think after image does a lot for us, actually. No hype because it's just another bomb build. True. Let's not go to a shop early on. What if we went this way? Took two elites. Hear me out here. What if we went this way? Took nothing but fights. Triple elites. And then we went into act four with one more billion gold. We could also go this way and get 999 gold, but we don't really have good applicators of, uh, of removing, so. We're gonna take a million fights. See one million cards with our prayer wheel. Yeah. I think I'm gonna take taking a little bit of damage. Okay. Especially since we can heal it all back. Ram hard. If Bing Bong pick Bing Bong for Bing Bong Bum Run. Excuse me, what the fuck did you just say? That's not fun. I was hoping to find the uh, eviscerate there since it would cost a zero. The chat make him mauled yesterday. What do you think? Do you think chat has what it takes to make me mauled? To make me angry because they do a lot of times they do i'll give you that they're fucking assholes sometimes <laughs> they are fucked up people sometimes a predator plus predator plus is another form of damage sure this deck is gonna get thick so i'm not allowed to get thicker you know don't be afraid of the thickness chat is what i'm trying to say don't be afraid of the thickness Get up, get down with the thickness. <laughs> I like that. I would love another bomb. A wraith form would be sick. If I were seeing a million cards. Gamba. Yikes. <laughs> I'll take a Gamba for sure. Like, for sure, for sure. Secret technique on one of our burst pluses. Burst plus Boomba. Apparition. Big. Huge. Huge. I love this double burst, actually, though. Smiley face and chat if you also really like this double burst. Outmaneuver plus doesn't seem like it does a whole lot. Deadly poison plus doesn't seem like it does a whole lot. You scare me a little bit. You 
scare me less now. Draw four extra cards this turn. All right, you scare me literally 0% now because I now can just do this. How am I killing the heart? It's a good thing I don't have to kill the heart this turn because then I would have to answer that question. But I don't have to kill the heart this turn, so it's nice. <laughs> uh, let's keep around our Noxious Fumes because we're going to get hit for one here. And then we heal it back up with the Noxious Fumes. How are you going to kill the heart? Boom. He's going to kill it with boom. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> the bomb solves all, smiley face. The bomb solves all. Um, We've got a lot of turns of intangible. That's one. One thing is we have a lot of turns of intangible because we have... Uh, we, 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 we thankfully have... I just took more damage, didn't I? Am I dumb? Chat. Yeah. Um... We have a lot of turns of intangible. Um, and we have... We can, by then, figure out some alternative forms of damage. We've got time. Tools of the Trade is pretty good with a kite. We could go this path and then peek at this shop. But I think it's probably better to take just more elites, right? Ooh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Turn one. Burst boom. This is actually so shit. Holy fuck, this is a bad turn, and we need to be scared of this fight now. Out of all of the RNG to get, this is really bad. Um, yeah. <laughs> this is not good. Power potion time. Okay, less bad. Less bad. Now we can keep our apparition around. It's cool. Okay, I was making sure it didn't do the bug where it accidentally puts it down because he clicked too fast. We're going to take the damage here. Where the fuck are my bursts, man? <laughs> Yo, you take one of those. I think we're good here, though, actually. Yeah, we're actually fine. Legitimately here, fine. Wow. Okay, this deck actually goes hard. Damn! I was really scared for a minute. That cuz that uh, but uh, like because that was one of the worst draws we could have had on turn 1. But it just proved that this deck kind of still goes hard. I got a ginger kind of shit. <laughs> Solid power potion? Yeah, it really was. I mean, it wasn't super necessary, but we got a cultist potion in in return, not again, not super good. The ginger is kind of shit. We could take a sneaky strike, but I don't think that that solves our alternative form of damage. 12 damage a turn is not not solving all our, our, our necessity for our alternative forms of damage. This is a good cultist potion fight. We don't need to get hasty with playing the bomb on turn one. Since we don't exactly have uh, the best uses for it. I think here you probably get your Noxus streams in play. That's awesome. Secret technique for a burst plus, And then you doppelganger. And you hold burst bomb. Yeah, Burst Shivs isn't the worst. Yeah, it'll get us through this fight for sure. I agree with you. Good burst, a burst, a burst, a burst. <gasps> is it just me or is the silent most comfortable character to play at highest engine? It's probably because of the amount of draw that she has. That's probably what you're feeling. Let's hit this so we can get the most benefit out of the draw of this.
Bursting and burst does nothing, right? It, it does the same thing as bursting and then bursting afterwards. It doesn't do anything extra. It doesn't do bad things. It just doesn't do extra. I think. Uh, let's keep you and you. This fight really could be worse for sure. Yeah. Oh, you're right. And you're right, you're right, gamer. We get double Boomba next turn. We've got burst intangibles coming up. I think as long as we play this deck smart and cool and clean, I think I think we're in good shape, right? Smart, calm, cool, and come and calm and clean. I definitely think that the cultist potion was like a good play, even though it doesn't look like it might be entirely necessary. But it does look like it is uh, doing something, you know? Yeah, 100 damage every every three turns is probably not the best. <laughs> I I can give you that one. I might not be the best. But what about 150 damage every four turns, huh? Is that better? No. <laughs> Just in, no. <laughs> the answer is still no. Um, things that could get us here uh, would be things we want to see. Obviously, like, good rare relics. Oops, I'm taking one damage. I'm not. Bag of marbles. We're just... We're not doing good, man. Tori, Tungsten Rod. Um, Gamble Block. Gambling Chip would be good. Yeah, these are all bad. Expertise is okay, but not always. I want to upgrade things. What do I want to upgrade? Probably my last Apparition. Apparition, Gamba. Yeah, we got good upgrades. Stone calendar for Omega Boom. <laughs> Omega Giga Boom. I'll save for one of my bursts. Nice. A tactician would be nice. Yeah, Tactician Plus would go hard. There's a lot of good things that we could find right now that I feel like we are struggling to find, but I am remaining positive, smiley face, smiley face, and Jennifer, you're also remaining positive. <laughs> I don't know. The deck's doing fun things, and I'm having a good time. If it if it, if it it falls sh uh, slightly short of winning, I'll be okay. I'll take another acrobatics, probably. I'll take an acrobatics plus instead, I think. And then, Yeah. <laughs> We don't have two campfires to upgrade two gambas, so I don't want a second one of those. I don't think I'll take this. You could take the thousand cuts. If we had the tactician, I'd be taking the thousand cuts. Because that's a good alternative form of damage. Hopefully our 555 gold is going to help us figure that scenario out as well. Ink bottle, you will be missed, my friend. You will be fucking missed, dog. I am sad to see you go. But love to watch you leave. Love that. Really like that. Okay. We've got intangibility next turn, and then a turn after that. Kaboom. I don't know what that motion I did with my hand was, but it was really cool. Smiley face in chat if you were intimidated by the motion that I did with my hand. <laughs> we can buy a tactician, yeah. We do have a courier. That's why like, I, I was like, we need to take this specific path so that we utilize the prayer wheel in order to see one more billion cards. And then also we save up Maw Bank plus courier, right? It's just actually a good play, and I'm really happy that I did this. You know? Who the hell just freaking subbed me? Wiener Schnitzel? Love you to death, man. Thank you so much for the fatty sub. One damage. Can I find one damage? 
That's pretty intimidating. I gotta hand it to you. We have a Sneko Skull? Now that could legitimately be an alternative form of damage. We're not gonna get a whole lot of them off, but another 50 damage every three turns could be pretty good. Thirty-seven cards. Yeah, but a lot of them are draw cards, man. I think we have that courier to remove half our deck. Yeah. This is an annoying fight for us for sure. Unless we find our burst apparitions pretty quickly. Hey, look, burst apparitions. I just wanted a block card, man. Twenty-seven damage is all we need to do here. I did twenty-seven damage. Hog, build up our pendant. Oh no, never mind. We need to do a little bit more damage. Can we draw one card? I didn't want to look to see if it was a skill. I knew that the card would auto draw it for me. That's awesome. What is the full title of the stream? If we hit 1,000 viewers, I'm going to buy Hannah McDonald's. Secret technique. On Bursto. Bursto again. An entire McDonald's. A franchise, yeah. It's going to be a franchisee. It's going to be sick, dude. 66 damage, turn one predator. Seems okay. Is that a sex thing? Yeah. Okay. Thirty-seven cards. That shit's gonna be useless, man. 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 I can't wait to see your useless fucking boom. Just seven cards here. We, yeah. It's better to keep burst acrobatics here. You happy? You having a good time? Nope, I want to kill him with a grand finale, just to prove the point. <laughs> Oh shit. No, my thing. Oh no. It was a useless card. Bombed. Get fucking bombed. I baited you. I baited you into the bomb. Burst again. Get bomb baited. Get bombastically baited. Bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a menace. I am an actual menace. Please put me in an asylum. Mm 
Wait, check this out. You ready? Now hold on. Oh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Boys, shut up! This content that you're watching right now has officially been given the Twitch chat seal of awesome content that you should come and watch the stream. Okay, watch this. Secret technique on reflex. Calculated gamba. Draw a billion cards. Okay. We draw this many. Look at this. You ready? So you do this. Now you just need to draw. This is going to draw your hand to six, right? If you play it now, it's going to draw two. If you play it now, it's going to draw three. That's what, That's the number that you want. What happened to Diego? He got yeeted across the room a while ago. Because I got mad at a video game. Oh, <laughs> this is a shitty draw. This is quite the poopy poopy draw. I must say. less poopy poopy but still pretty poopy poopy because we don't get off the bomb or yeah we literally get off neither of them what could we draw here they would save that you could draw uh if we draw a dagger throw doesn't do it <laughs> that also doesn't do it it gains us energy but it doesn't help us with the, the thing <sighs> okay good thing we have a billion draw that's what we're gonna rely on here let's skip this let's burst our apparition and then we gotta fucking go. We gotta we gotta hunker down and we gotta go, man. Okay, this is good. Let's do this. Let's do this. Tools of the trades, great. And now let's burst an acrobatics. So we can draw through our entire fucking deck. Okay. Burst this. Calculated Gamba is really good. We do this, and you keep this and this. Secret technique for Boomba. It's good. I don't want to just burst another apparition. That feels bad, man. So I think we have to try to draw the bomb naturally. It's just not going to happen, is it? Might just be okay to take 30 here. And look for the value out of our apparition. Yep. I think so. That's good. I don't like the grand finale draw here. I'm a big fan. five next turn and then we draw five next turn we can draw five again with the reflex and an acrobatics okay. this is still bursted nice. could also draw four this turn but that's pretty bad you don't want to do that 
I don't think. All right. The alternative is like acrobatics one here, or acrobatics negative here, and then you draw three, and then you hope that you get your adrenaline. Because if you get adrenaline, that's two. You want adrenaline or expertise. As long as those aren't the two bottom cards of the deck, you're pretty good. Yeah. And I think I'll probably keep Gamba as well. No, I'll probably keep Acrobatic. No, it's definitely Gamba. No, you don't want Gamba because you're going to want to keep the, um, the Apparition that comes in hand. So you're probably going to keep... You're going to keep Burst in Grand Finale, I think. So now we just need to draw for one with expertise. It's easy. Doable. Actually is. Yeah. Can you do this? So it'll draw you to six. So you do this. Grand finale. Sick. And then we're going to burst apparition now so that when we redraw our deck, it's in the draw pile. We still have uh, um, a burst on, so let's do this so we can draw a million cards next turn. Hello, Boomba. Boomba? Alright, that's not Boomba, that's Grand Finale. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm not paying attention to the stupid messages in chat right now, because I kind of have to focus. Is it good to play prepared right now, is the question? Yeah, prepared's a negative draw, and we like that right now. And I say stupid as in like messages that I make me unfocus. That's what stupid means to me, by the way. Your message doesn't actually have to be stupid. Um, okay. You do this. And then you draw two here. Did I fuck this up? I might have fucked this up. I think I fucked up. But we do have burst bomb coming up, so that should be fine. Yeah, it was one off. Wait, no, we had <laughs> we had fucking extra draw this turn. We Omega fucked up. It's fine. We have burst bomb, and then we just have to survive one turn. But it's actually gonna be like super fucking hard. Actually, it won't be super hard. We don't even need. I kind of want to... I want to get to Eviscerate here without losing it. So let's do this. Really? No Eviscerate? Well, that's tough. Thanks for all the supportive messages, chat. Really appreciate it. <clears throat> now that I can count on you guys.
That's two of my bursts, really? I'm so close to killing you. Fight number one. <laughs> hey, fight number two. The harder one. The much harder one, actually. Oh, no. This one's actually a lot harder. Because he has 300 health. That one's not easy to do. There's the burst. Found it. A secret technique for an apparition here, yeah. Uh, probably don't want to play Tools of the Trade. Need to start thinking about grand finales. That three health actually might matter. Okay, grand finale easy this turn. Or next turn. We could do next turn, actually. No, you can do this turn, too. I don't think I care if I do it this turn or next turn. I don't think I give a shit about you, either. That's fucking crazy insane. <laughs> That's really good. Hey, grand finale. Do you have another apparition down there? draw one card this turn, we get it next turn. We're not exactly blocking for a whole lot. Um, how do I... If I go right now, if I play this, I draw to nine, and then I draw... So I need to play one card and then burst acrobatics. If we find escape plan, we get it. Oh, wrong burst. Fuck me, dude. All right, I fucked this one. All right, we just need to find our... Um... Escape plan. Oh, I didn't have... I don't have tools of the trade in play. I'm so used to having tools of the trade in play. All right, I fucked it up. Sorry, chat being so slow makes me really depressed and then I don't play as well. How dare you not speak chat as you wait with bated breath. Okay, we can guarantee you get it next turn. And that plus... So we need to, like, ideally we kill you this turn, but there's no fucking way to do that. So we just, like, actually just probably die two turns from now.
We can deal... No, we can, if we can deal 12 damage, which we actually can. Okay, never mind. Gotcha, bitch. And we get the bomb next turn, too. That's actually really good. Yeah, we keep our last intangible for this turn. That's good. Don't like that I immediately drew into that. <laughs> Not a big fan of that. Okay, remember that we draw two extra next turn? Get that bird fucker. <laughs> How do you know he fucks birds, man? get it, can we? If I played acrobatics there, I actually think I can get it. At least we get the Evis, right? That's nice. Uh, let's keep burst bomb. No, we don't need burst. Let's keep bomb and acrobatics. Okay. Now we just have to figure out how to deal with this shit. We just have a million other things to figure out now. How to block. We haven't really had to do that yet. Well, we get it off next turn. No, we don't. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me that you do- Oh my god. Oh, that's so sad. Alright. We don't get it off. That's so sad. Now we just have to block for 14 times 3. No big deal, really. And I really want to play this Gamba, but it is terrible for us to do that. Do I rely on more? The bomb with three bursts in my drop pile? Probably. Probably. I don't think so. I think Pendip's probably more likely to go off before we die. Right? The idea here is to kill him with Pendip this turn, I think. We have a blade dance down there. Let's try to use that. Next skill is played twice. If we get drawn now, we go to nine. Get rid of one. Let me go to 10, and we draw one less than we need to. So instead, you play Predator and then Acrobatics, because you'll go to 6. Which will then take you to 8. Get rid of 1. 
boom, you play. Eviscerate in the grand finale, you win. Right? Don't get rid of the reflex. Zorbrez, Vertigo, Alex, think you guess what follows. upgrade on something. What do we need an upgrade on the most? Maybe Noxious? Noxious for the hard fight? To just get that much extra damage with uh, Sneko Skull? Could also be Sucker Punch or Neutralize for more weaken on turn 1 slash turn 2 of the hard fight. Secret Technique, maybe? It's a good option. Doppelganger is a good option. Last Burst is a good option. Grand Finale? Also not terrible. I think I like neutralize for more. No, because we don't rely on the weakening. Yeah, we want noxious fumes for sure. I literally, after that long of that, that fight, I forgot that we don't actually block things. Okay. A lot of these things are good. Oh my God, I'm gonna pee. I gotta pee. I gotta pee. And then we're definitely taking this potion. Definitely taking that card. That's good. Definitely taking this. Yo! Thank you for subscribing. I think it could be master of strategy. I think it could be card remove. I think it could be toolbox. I think toolbox could do a lot. I think I like the idea of remove toolbox. It uses our gold the most and it could be a master of strategy. <laughs> It also could be another bum. All right, let's remove. I think it's defend. I think it might be a defender move. But I think I'm going to go with it. Predator? No, Predator's been very useful. 40 damage sometimes with Pendib too. It's sick. I really wish I could see my starting hand right now. Because if I could see my starting hand that I had my well laid plans, I would take the block here. I guess I'll just take the Apotheosis. Do I even want to play this? Like, actually? Nope. Do we want to burst the bomb? Or nightmare the bomb? I'm questioning now if I want to play Blade Dance to get closer to Grand Finale. Uh, pen I think I do. Draw one less. Hey, Grand Finale. I don't think I want to grab Burst. I think I want to... What do I want here, dude? What if I grab Calculated Gamble and then use my Distilled Chaos so it can't Calculated Gamble me? <laughs> yeah, what are your thoughts on that? Your thoughts are Apple Cat Run? Same, dude. Damn. Getting unlucky. Getting unlucky with our draw order here. Not a huge fan of it. Piercing whale, I guess. Okay. 
We should be good, right? Should be able to find it here. Especially with reflexes and acrobatics. We draw six cards at the beginning of the turn. Which will put us at... Six cards puts us at... Okay, six cards puts us at nine. Nine plus acrobatics. It'll be six cards plus the two in my hand, so that'll be eight. So if we have... Acro if we have acrobatics, we could draw... Two, uh, you want a secret technique here, right? Because if we draw six cards next turn, we can go to eight, and then with acrobatics, we can draw two. Oh, is he gonna put burns in our draw pile next fucking turn? Oh, I gotta think. Stop making me have to think, you fuck. Or are these the the burns in our? I don't know. No, because he puts them at the on his turn. I don't know what I'm supposed to fucking do, man. I, I, I'm trying to think, but like, my brain does not comprehend what's going on and I'm just struggling. I'm out here straight up struggling. I'm out here struggle bussing, you know what I'm saying? Okay, if we get rid of one card here, we're gonna go to seven, which means we can draw four. That's bad. <laughs> so instead we should draw three Now, does this motherfucker put burns in my draw pile this turn? No, right? Because we would know if he's going to do that because it would say debuff, right? So he's not going to do it. So we just have to take a bunch of damage. So that we can pog, baby. Play as many attacks as possible so that we can get our thing back up. Our pendant back up as, as high as, as we can. Oh, I love this. So nice of you. To give 99 block. <laughs> uh, I'll leave it at 8 so I can weaken him with, uh, with my neutralize. On turn two of next fight. Okay, okay. A strike dummy! <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I'll take that. We can nightmare the bomb! Told you it might be a master of strategy, chap. Bursting apparition here is smart, right? We're definitely doing this. It's always happening. We play burst, we draw three cards. I like drawing three cards. Don't draw me another apparition, please. <laughs> Not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. But I got burst boomba! Burst boomba! So we have to burst an apparition here, right? Like it's, there's no other way around this. Am I crazy? Unless we're able to draw, we should probably look in our draw. First, because we do not still have hovering kite. What the fuck did we put? No, wait, do we do still have hovering? Did we, what did we play? We should still have hovering kite, right? It's not glowy glowying. Am I going crazy? Chat? <laughs> feel like I'm losing my damn mind. It's supposed to be, you know, it's supposed to be pulsing. K kite never glows? Dude, kite's fucking cringe.
Make room in the hand so we can draw a billion cards. Draw me one time for the one. Just one fucking time for the one. Draw me my well-laid plans. That is like, not exactly it, but I'm not upset at you. <laughs> I'm not mad at you for that. Wait, is this a dupe pot? And then we can... Wait, if we dupe pot, we can burst Nightmare on Apparition. That's a dupe pot. What the fuck is going on? Shut the fuck up, Gerald! Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna blow up this heart. I'm the McDonald's coming after the arteries. <laughs> His name is Alexander. That's what he wants you to think, man. Me and Gerald go way back. <laughs> Who the fuck is Gerald? Shut up. You wish you were Gerald. All right, we're going to burn our thing here. Let's keep around you. I don't think I want to keep secret technique here. All right, 100 damage inbound, baby. Bye bye. 100 damage inbound. Not our best draw. Not our best draw here. Really not our best draw. Holy shit. Okay. We're already drawing an extra card next turn, but what if we drew more extra cards? Okay. That was 100D. Wait, can we bullshit this next turn? Okay. So if we draw two cards here, chat, 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 listen to me. One of the, 50% of the time, we will draw a burst. Special delivery. If we draw a burst, okay? We're get, we, okay, if we draw a burst, we can nightmare. And then next, and then keep two cards in our hand. And we'll have three plus three. Three plus three plus the two cards that we keep, and then we draw two cards. If we don't do that, hold on. If we don't do that, right now, right now we can, right now we can, if we nightmare right now, we'll draw three cards, we'll keep two, and then we'll draw five. That's shit. So we have to. Yeah. Is that worth doing? Uh, yeah, we have Pen the Grand Finale. That's extremely worth doing. I was like, what's the alternative? Shitting my pants? <laughs> yeah! <sighs> I'm going to pass out. Now, do we, do we nightmare the Grand Finales? <laughs> I think yes. I think that's a flawless idea. What could go fucking wrong? Is my question. YouTube! Boys! This content that you're watching right now has officially been given the Twitch chat seal of awesome content that you should come and watch the stream. If I hit you in the face, you have to stop. If I hit the camera, you Order. have to stop right now. You're just doing the, the chat triggers at random times like they do all the time. Bullet. If I hit the camera, you have to stop. It's bam. It's out of battery. Okay, so we should burst. 
We should burst apparition nightmare grand finale tools of the trade slimed. Any objections to that turn? And then we keep apparition grand finale in our hand. Does tools mess it up? No, I'll go over what we're doing again. I'll go over the plan. I'll go over the plan right now. <laughs> so right now this turn, we are going to play nightmare twice off of burst. Doesn't matter what you nightmare, our plan is grand finale because that's going to be pogged up content. But if we keep two cards in our hand with our well-laid plans, that's two cards, right? Then we, we nightmare, that's three cards. Nightmare, that's three cards. Doesn't matter how many cards we're intended to draw next turn, we're only going to draw two because that's all that we can fit. Does that make sense? So you are bursting nightmare. Yeah, we have a burst plus. It's a burst plus. So we're going to burst Apparition so that we take less damage off of the Beat of Death. Then we're going to Nightmare. It'll burst the Nightmare. We get seven Grand Finales in our hand next turn. Now, could we do it with the Apparition and it technically be better? Yes. If we lose because of this, does it matter? No. <laughs> you got to remember that. Does it matter if you lose if you do something cool? No. Unless it's in real life, but this isn't real life. Are you a loser if you burst the Apparitions here? If you're not on a world record breaking streak on A20 to beat out Jorbs' record, yes, it does make you a loser. <laughs> I'm sorry, it does. I don't make the rules. Well, dude, we actually could Nightmare Void. We could use one of the Nightmares on Void and draw three Voids next turn, and it would still be fine. I know the smart play, and I did say I'm going to play my very best. And then the game gave me a bottled bomb and a grand finale, and I had to fucking frick this deck out of nowhere. Is seven grand finales enough? Okay, now we have to make sure that when we hit end turn here, we boom, boom, confirm. I don't think the smart play is actually to double play uh, both uh, apparitions. I don't think it's I don't think it's smart to play both apparitions because you want to get the 200 damage cap at least. I think you play like at least one more. <laughs> ah, just maybe one more. Honestly, that stacking grand finale, it's actually pretty, our, our thing, it's really, it's actually pretty good. And look at this. Perfect piercing whale draw. So we can bomba. Piercing whale. <laughs> yeah, he is the best gamer of all time, some have said. We still have four apparitions down there. I kind of want to keep double finale. Is that good? I think so, right? Double finale is the play. Uh, we also have four... <laughs> We also have three grand finales down there. So maybe it's not. <laughs> maybe we don't need it. I don't know. Let's keep this in this. Hmm. Might be good to get rid of this one. All right, do I want to play the Apparition this turn so that I take less damage from Beat of Death? I think so. Still have so many cards to get through. Yep. Okay. 
Okay. <clears throat> I think you ditch this apparition here. I think you play Blade Dance. Get yourself up to a pen nib again. We have Boomba this turn too. Okay, then you keep double finale. And we draw six cards. And then with one Acrobatics Plus, we get there. So just get the Acrobatics Plus, probably. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yep. Easy. So something to worry about here. Um, dying. Hmm. Weird. Never worried about that before. Do I burst defend here? Yeah. Yep. All right, we just have to block like one turn. Like one turn, this dude's gonna do times 15 and we just have to like barely block it. That's pretty easy, right? We can do that, I think. We could also burst Calculated Gamble here. We could also burst Bomba here. Burst Bomba here is actually really good. Secret Technique, Burst Bomba. So you defend Secret Technique, Burst Bomba. That's perfect. It's actually a perfect turn. They said the perfect turn didn't exist. <gasps> Yep. What, do I have six grand finales? Uh, it's seven, actually, boss. <laughs> it's seven grand finales. Thank you very much. Do we play this apparition? I don't think you do. Make you hold your calculated gamble. Oh shit, five years, man. Here's to five more, brother. Thanks. What was your boy, Sam? Thank you for the 60. All right, now we just got to block one by 15. We can figure that out, right? Right, chat? Okay. <laughs> this is going to be hard. We've got a lot of block cards down there. But a lot of block cards, man. So we can burst, defend. It gives us eight block. Eight plus five. So it's 13. We literally only need one more block cut after that. And then if we acrobatics, goes to 12. And then if we find one more defense off that acrobatics, we're good. If not, we have to gamba into two defend cards. Right? That's good. Okay, good. Hey, look at that. I did it. I keep Gamba here, right? All right, we have 100 damage coming this turn. Which is pretty sick. I actually probably need that. I think you get rid of this. That's not a good draw. Um, or is it? <laughs> I don't know. No, we got 100 damage, so if we keep these and we can play these, then we win. So let's play this. So that we have, we only take one damage from Beat of Death next turn. 
And then we can play this just for funsies. Oh, I love for funsies. Now the question is, we want to play escape plan here because the ideal draw. Big brain, one last time, activate. <laughs> All right. So if you play Gamma this turn, you draw six next turn. That puts you at uh, eight cards in your hand, smiley face, minus one, minus one. That's seven cards in your hand. Then if you play an acrobatics, you go to exactly 10. Um, and if you have an un a prepared in your hand, you win. Boom, done. If you don't have a prepared in your hand, if you have a burst in your hand, um, and you have a burst left in your hand, no, we're not playing. No, no, we're not playing game. We're, play, we're talking about escape plan. Sorry if I'm if, if, if I spoke incorrectly. Um, there's two things in your deck that could draw you one. One of those is expertise. One of those is prepared. The other one is if you have a burst, you'll go to 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 the original allotted seven cards, and then you'll play burst. So we're at seven cards. If we play burst, no, burst burst acrobatics never works in this situation. But expertise always does. So I think it might be better not to play it. Um, because if, 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 so if we play escape plan, we have 10 cards. We draw six next turn and then we'll have seven in our hand. Because we're keeping two and then we have, we have to get rid of one. Um, if you play acrobatics, you draw to full and you have one card left in the draw pile. If you have a, an expertise or you have a prepared, we can figure that out and we can get down to the, the correct amount of cards. All right? If, chat, I just realized we don't block next turn. It's literally either we win next turn or we fucking, no, we don't die because we don't have damage incoming, but either way. Um, if we play burst, we go to six cards and then we would go to nine cards, then to eight cards and then two. So that'd be one more than we would need. So that'd be bad. But if we do the opposite where we don't play escape plan and we burst acrobatics, we win. But if we draw an acrobatics next turn and then we draw another acrobatics next turn. So we have... Still, we draw to eight, and then we go to seven, right? And then we have an acrobatics next turn. We draw to full, but then there's two cards left in the draw pile. But then we have nine cards left in hand. If we play one, yeah, it's always that you don't play. Yeah, you always don't play it. You always don't play it. Because the likelihood that you have two acrobatics in hands is really, really high, and that wins. If you just draw two acrobatics or acrobatics expertise, we win. Don't play escape plan, draw two acrobatics. Step one complete. Step two. Fuck. Shit. Ah! Okay, that's fine. This is fine. We're fine. No need to panic. Chat, do not panic. Do not panic. We're fine. No, we just need to draw an acrobatics. Yeah, we just need to draw an acrobatics. Right? We just draw an acrobatics. <clears throat> you can skip. You can skip. No, I fucking can't. You dumbasses. Stop backseating. We've had tools of the trade the entire damn fight. It draws six cards a turn. We just need both of our acrobatics to be not be the last two cards on the top of our draw pile. Is there a way that we can guarantee to get it, though? Expertise plus prepared plus acro. Stop backseating. And also, you're once again wrong. If you play the expertise, you draw zero cards. So, <laughs> and then your 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 also your play there is when you do that, I die because if you play four cards, I need I, I like it, it, I actually don't die. But it, either way, like it's is literally if I play this, I draw zero cards. How does that fucking help me at all? We just have to. I'm I'm, I'm uh, let me focus. I also need to not look at you. That's on me. That's my fault. My bad that I looked at you when you were backseating. But please stop. That would be great. Now watch me think and be better than you. Here we go. <clears throat> this right last turn was lethal with passive poison. Yeah, but that's not fucking cool. Oh my god, I won with eviscerate. All right, loser. <laughs> got him. <laughs> All right, now we got him. <laughs> So if we acrobatics into another acrobatics, we win, right? Because you go to nine cards and then you go to... No, you actually don't win. No, you actually don't win if you double acrobatics. If You, you don't win if you, if you double acrobatics. You actually don't win. But if we prepared... If we prepared... It's always... Prepared is always net negative a card. So if I... Uh, prepared is always draw negative. 
So you'll be at you'll be at one last card in your hand. So you'll be at six. And then you can draw one with expertise. And then you can draw three and you win. Wow, that was like crazy. And literally no one said that in chat. We tried thoughts and prayers. I love that They're insane Texan. With a new I, dude, I, I absolutely love... <laughs> I absolutely love that the guy named Insane Texan is the one that says thoughts and prayers. It's very on brand. I love the RP. <laughs> love it. All right, so you do this. Now we're at six cards. Now you play this. Now we're at six cards. Now you play this. And now we're there. And now you play this. And now we're there. And now I can sit here. And I can let the poison take him out. And I can live on. But that would not be grand. And for this. Eldritch Blade. Is my finale. <laughs> Hell yeah. And that is the way that you win a slay the spire run.